It's time for our interesting stories report with Richard Southern and Richard we're looking at a mysterious high in the skies at about a U.S. military base. It's been a while since uh, you let me do a, a UFO uh, story Erica. So, uh, Overdue. Here we go. Thank you. Um, you know, it's an interesting story. It came this week from two notable journalists uh, that report on this. We're looking here at what they say is a, a giant black triangular shaped UFO hovering over a California military base. It was caught on six different videos and witnessed by 50 U.S. Marines back in 2021. This is Camp Wilson. It shows what they say is a, a an object with six lights hovering for 10 minutes. One video showed troops shooting flares in the sky in an attempt to illuminate this object, at which point it disappears. Now, it's important to note, north the, note the source. Journalists Jeremy Corbell and George Knapp released this, and they have a good record of releasing videos that the U.S. military later confirms is true. Remember, the U.S. government has said UFOs are essentially real. They are a danger to U.S. military aircraft, but they've stopped short of saying exactly what they are. What's your take on that, Erica? I, it's it's worth checking out. I mean, you don't know where it's coming from, right? UFO just means we don't know what it is. So true. Yeah, could be anything. Okay, you've heard the saying, "Keep your eyes on the road." That's especially true if you're driving the latest BMW model. This is wild. BMW said one of its new sedans coming out this fall will let drivers change lanes simply by using their eyes. This is the new BMW 5 Series. It, like many cars, has this highway assist program that allows drivers to go long distances on the highway without touching the steering wheel or pedals. BMW, though, now adding this new feature to it, whereby drivers will be able to change lanes simply by looking at one of the side mirrors. So if you want to change lanes to the right, Eric, you look at the right mirror, to the left, you look at the left mirror. Uh, of course, the car makes sure you know that there's nothing coming and that it's safe to to do so. This is just the latest in sort of self-driving technology. I like to look all over the place when I'm <laughs> yeah. driving in a car, so I get they would get really confused with me. It'd be, it'd be very erratic driving if you were if you were behind the it wheel. It would it would veer it would veer into the nearby Taco Bell because I'd be <laughs> looking all over the place. You just ended up there. I guess you'll have to eat Taco Bell. <laughs> okay. Fun. What a shame. <laughs> Let's end with a story uh, that's absolutely absurd. An argument over Hot Pockets got a little too heated, let's say. I don't know. Have you ever had a roommate, Erica? No. <laughs> no? Okay. I've had the roommate, and I can attest, this is something you got to really pay attention to. You know, who takes what food? This is uh, Clifton Wilson, a 64-year-old. He's been uh, charged now after allegedly shooting his roommate during, yes, a dispute over the last hot pocket that was in the fridge. This is kind of like one of those pizza pocket deals, right? Uh, apparently, a, a heat roommate takes the last one, and Williams shoots him in the buttock uh, to, uh, to make his point, Erica. Luckily, the roommate is just fine. You know... You think they would have talked this out because when you microwave one of these things, you have about two hours before it's at an <laughs> edible temperature, right? That is very true. That's very true. It seems like maybe it came to a boiling point. Maybe the, the hot pocket was the, the final straw. So. <laughs> there might have been something else going on. There. I You're think right. so. Okay. Thanks, Richard. We'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.